Hey guys, I'm the math professor, Kyle Martin. This is the channel where we tell you how to do your math homework fast and accurate. Today we're talking segment addition postulate, okay, as part of our geometry proof reasons playlist. And we're gonna tell you everything you know about segment addition postulate, as well as give you two examples of real life geometry proofs, all within the next two minutes. Let's go. Okay, a quick definition of segment addition postulate says that if B is between points A and C, then AB plus BC equals AC. In other words, if AB is the first part of the line segment, BC is the second part of the line segment, you can add those together to get the entire thing. So if AB is seven, BC is 13, AB plus BC, the entire thing would equal 20. Hey guys, here's a real example of a two column proof that uses segment addition, okay? I have kind of breezed through these first three because given this line up here, it tells me that AL is equal to LS, that's just gonna be our given. LS equals itself, that's the reflexive property. And then if I just add LS to both those, then I have uh, AL plus LS equals SK plus LS by the addition property. This is where this proof gets a little bit interesting because now AL plus LS, right? AL plus LS, the two parts equal the whole, that's gonna be segment addition. Okay, similarly, SK plus LS equals LK. SK plus LS equals LK. Part plus the part equals the whole. Again, segment addition. Okay, and then lastly, we can prove that AS equals LK by substitution, okay, because up here in this line, those two things equal each other. And since now I know that uh, this first part equals AS, the second part equals LK. If they equal each other and they both equal AS and LK, obviously by substitution, AS equals LK. All right, proof example number two. Okay, proof two, um, we're first given AC equals BD. Of course, this is our given. Okay, and it says AC, right? AC equals AB plus CD. Well, again, that's segment addition. Same thing for BD equals BC plus CD. So those both are gonna be segment addition. Okay, then by substitution, I can sub those in and say that AB plus BC equals BC plus CD. And then lastly, if I subtract BC from both of these, I'm just left with AB equals CD, and that's again by subtraction. All right, guys, I hope this video helped about segment addition postulate. If it did, leave a comment saying why or why it didn't help. And then also, if you consider subscribing, you already need help. Chances are you'll need help again, so you might as well subscribe so this is easier to find in the future. And then lastly, if you need more help on these uh, geometry proof reasons, check out my playlist about geometry proof reasons or other topics, all in the description down below.